I apologize to start this video, it's kind of windy, but uh, I'm just, you know, chilling and enjoying the view. Great view. And uh, today, as you can see by the title, I'm going to be showing you guys my apartment in downtown Toronto. So let's get going. Unfortunately, today I don't have a cameraman, but I do have a bunch of stuff that I could put my camera on. So, you're gonna have to work with me today, but let's get started with the entrance. As you can see, this is the front door. Over here, you can see a shoe rack, and over here we got the coat, coat closet with a little key hang holder thing, key hanger holder, key, yeah, I'm just gonna call it a key hanger. Uh, this is where I can put my keys once I come in, and I can always remember to bring them when I when I go out so uh, yeah moving along stepping in here we got the bathroom that is indeed me what's going on um, you got two little mirrors and over here similar to my Waterloo apartment you got a little or a big shelf actually behind the mirror you got this curved looking sink that goes inwards you got some essentials over there and uh, you got the toilet you got the garbage you got this, which is like a heated uh, pad that, that like kind of dries your feet when you come out of the shower. And you got the shower in here. Over here, we got another shoe rack just because I have a lot of shoes. So I kind of needed more than just this. And this is kind of for guests if anybody comes in with their shoes here. But over here, we got my kind of shoe rack. And in here behind the Pittsburgh Penguins logo, we got a nice little laundry room. In laundry room you got Tide Pods, you got two um, laundry bags, blacks or colors and whites. You got this vacuum. It's similar to a Dyson, but it's like an off-brand cheap version of it. I am in no state to afford a Dyson, so we're just gonna have to go with this, but I I'm happy with it. And if we come around here, hello, this is indeed uh, the kitchen and the dining area. Um, it is my first day settling in here, so we kind of got things all over the place like this should not be here This should be back in my back in my room, but yeah, very nice kitchen very spacious um, This is where people are gonna eat where I usually eat if I'm not watching something and uh, great marble kitchen counter uh, Here let, let me let me show you what we actually got in detail Starting with the fridge. We just bought some groceries. We got a sub asparagus Patties, sandwich, uh, bolognese, some salmon. We got some Gatorade, and some orange juice, cokes, ground beef and mushrooms, um, some salsa and some teriyaki sauce. We got just some easy food, some easy makeable food, and we got obviously a big, big old dishwasher right here. In here, we got some creatine, some Ziploc bags, and these are kind of like cooking utensils, uh, bags of Doritos, and some of the boxes that. Uh, were for the kitchen stuff. Obviously in the sink, I just made some dinner, so I'm gonna wash this, don't you worry. But this isn't a great look, but we got the pots and pans in here in the sink. Got some dishwashing soap. And this is the stove itself. You can see it's actually electric. So if I wanna turn on this stove, I just hold this down and you can heat it up. Just turn it off, hold this to turn it off. Only thing I don't like about this is it collects a lot of fingerprints, but easily wipe that. And over here, you got you got a microwave, got some water, and over here you got some some more cleaning supplies just to keep the place nice and tidy. Over here is uh, basically the workstation. You can see, actually I don't know if you can see from there, but we got a PS5 over here, got the main monitor over here, got the laptop powering everything over here. We got the ring light to give me some light when I'm filming some sit down talking videos. And uh, yeah, I'm missing a few things. You can see I don't have a keyboard. Uh, I didn't like the old keyboard that I had, so I'm, I'm trying to get a new one. And I also don't have a sound bar, which is probably why you see friends playing, but you don't hear anything coming out. I could always just use my laptop. I was thinking maybe this is the guy for me because he understands me. But it's not the same. Having a sound bar it just sounds a lot clearer and it kind of fills the room. 
Um, but yeah, this is this is the workstation and it's uh, I like it. The desk is nice and big, got a lot of space and yeah, it's very good. Moving along from the desk, you're probably wondering why is there this like random shelf with a couch pointed towards it? Now, I think you guys can guess, but we're gonna have a TV right there just on top of the shelf. Uh, but this shelf is kind of just, these are kind of just for looks. Although I do, that is my favorite book series. That is a very nice um, Harry Potter uh, book collection in like a Hogwarts gift box, bottle of prime, my pair of uh, Beats headphones. And uh, yeah, I still gotta fill out the bottom two shelves, but just imagine a TV here and this is the couch. It's a nice plain beige couch. We've gotta get some couch cushions, obviously. It's just not the same without it, but the one thing we are missing is the bedroom and let me show you to the bedroom. If you guys are avid viewers, you will recognize this bed. This is the exact bed I have at home. I just, we just moved it all the way over here. Got a nice Manchester United scarf lining the top of the bed. Got my iPad with a few chargers and I actually dropped my phone charger over here. And on that side, we got a lamp. The only bad thing about this bedroom, uh, you can see apart from the lamp, there are no lights. There's no lights on the ceiling, absolutely nothing. And uh, but yeah, that's the only downside of this entire thing. Very cool sliding door wall thing. I do like to keep it open to let some sun in when I wake up. I like having the sun kind of wake me up. And over here we got two closets. This closet is for long sleeves. And as you can see, there are many. Over here, short sleeves along with the backpack, which I'm actually gonna go grab and put right there. And yeah, that is the apartment tour done. Um, the only thing I'd say this place is missing is my presence. You can't really, like, apart from that, like one penguin sign, a couple of my stuff over there, it doesn't seem to have a homey vibe. And uh, I am gonna try and change that. I'm gonna try to get some photos up, uh, get get some of uh, some photos of my friends and my family in this apartment uh, to just make it feel more at home. But apart from that, great place, can't complain. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I love doing these types of videos and uh, I hope you guys enjoyed watching them. Yeah, more videos to come. I'll see you guys soon. Peace.